more than a year after a torrential downpour killed two boaters at Apache Lake, a victim's family is suing, alleging the state and Maricopa County didn't do enough to protect her. Team 12's Nyella Charles has more on the lawsuit in the works. Monsoon storms came out of nowhere on Apache Lake in August of last year. Deanna Peterson didn't survive when her boat capsized. She was on a trip with her fiancé and friends. The lawsuit filed by Deanna's estate lays out why they feel the state and county are at fault. It says the state and county agencies knew the area had a risk for intense flooding due to the burn fire scar and had an obligation to monitor conditions at Tonto National Forest, detect potential risks, and warn boat goers like Deanna. After the boat capsized last year, first responders said this. The flash flood just came rushing down, obviously given no time for anything, and there was no resistance. That's why the boat capsized so quickly. They pointed at the burn scar and all the resulting debris that surrounded the boat, making it difficult to escape. Deanna isn't the only one that lost her life that day. Her friend Rick Legrand also passed away. He loved his boat. He loved being here at the lake. This was his backyard. First responders took days to find Deanna's body and more than a week to find Rick's because the debris and runoff in the water made for a difficult search. We reached out to state and county agencies for comment, but all declined. Nyla Charles, 12 News.